Hey everyone, welcome to Uncaptured Rascal Show. I think ANC is taking us for a serious ride. It's, it's you know, when you have this kid at home where whenever you try to discipline them, it's like you are, you are, you are, you are, put, you are putting petrol inside fire. That's what ANC is doing to us. I mean, there was this community where... <laughs> I'm not even laughing yet. <laughs> they were opening a tap. Hmm? They, 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 they built a tap for a community. Not that they're gonna they putting a tap in each and every household. No, they building a tap for a community. And they went there to go and do an opening of a tap. You know, just when you thought you, you've seen it all, and then you're, you're, the president, Cyril Ramaphosa, goes and close a pothole on a road whereby there is no road actually there is no tar sorry there is no tar and he goes there and closes a pothole <laughs> wow you know you, are, you know just when you thought you've seen it all when you thought hey i've seen it all and then they just put a cherry on top of the ice cream or on top of a cake yeah, 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 yeah. I think 2024 is far, guys. I really think it's far for these clowns, these hooligans, these fools to be out of power. And I do support anyone that is going to say, I'm putting the ANC into ashes, I'm burying it. I fully support that party. I'm not going to support any party that will side with the ANC. Oh, that will save the ANC from it drastically. I mean, for goodness sake, how do you how do you deploy all your committee members to go and close a pothole where there is no tar? And I think this was supposed to be like maybe a PR stunt or something. That's what I'm thinking. I think it was supposed to be like a PR stunt. I don't know, guys, but I think we need to wake up to this ANC. This is not the ANC that is a liberation party. I really don't think this is a, this is a liberation party. I really, really, not in, even in, on my conscious mind, this is a liberation party. It's not. It has now turned into a self-destructing, a self, self-destructing machine that persuades to make those who believe are in power to make themselves as uh, uh, rich. ANC is not anymore about people, you know, our poor people. I can't remember when, when last they, they ran a, a, a campaign of making sure that the, the land that is allocated, it's now, there's now a house being built there, or there's houses already built there. They're really taking us for a ride. And if us South Africans don't stand up in 2024, we have ourselves to play. Because 2024 will be the change of dynamics in terms of politics in South Africa. It will be. And if we don't want to take um, ourselves serious, we have ourselves to play. We don't have to blame anyone after 2024 when ANC is still the ruling party. We need to blame ourselves. We need to even blame those that don't want to go out and vote. I mean, I'm, I, I, I even wonder how much do they pay for that tender? Because ANC, even if something is one million, to them it's not one million, it's five million. Or it's seven million. The rest must go to the pockets. They will pocket the rest. I'm really wondering how much <laughs> was that uh, pothole close <laughs> wow just when you thought you've seen it all thank you guys for listening please don't forget to subscribe let us grow this channel let us bring all our topics let's have discussion about them you know um, don't forget to subscribe don't forget to like and leave any comments I'll come back to you thanks for listening cheers